Hello everyone. Today we will talk about the shares and dividends. When we talk about shares, it is shares which is important. There are two more terms which are associated with this. One is debentures and one is bonds. Now we talk about a company first of all because in this chapter the most important is the fundamentals of the company. Company runs on two bases. One in which a person becomes the partner of the company and in the other case the company can take loan from the person suppose a person is a partner of a company that means he has taken the shares of that company when a company has taken the loan from a person it means that either he has purchased the debentures or he has purchased the bonds Debentures are basically the short term loan taken by the company. Bonds are basically the loan which is long term. In the case of debentures, it is basically the lock in period in which you cannot take money from the company is either 3 years or 2 years while in the case of bonds it may be 10 years or more than 10 years. But in class 10th, you don't get debentures and bonds. On these two debentures and bonds, basically we only get the interest from the company. And we are not the partners of the company. While in the case of shares, as we are the partner of the company, so whatever the profit company gets, that profit is divided among all the shareholders and that profit is known as dividend. As an example, we can say that if a company's value is 100 crores and a person has purchased the share of 1 crore, that means this person is 1% partner of the company. If the company earns a profit of 50 lakhs, in a span of one year. So after at the end of the one year, this person, because he is the partner for 1%, will get 1% of 50 lakhs as the dividend. So in the case of shares, he is the partner, while in the case of debentures and bonds, he has just provided the loan to the company and he is not the partner of the company. In the next video, we will define about shares theoretically completely. Thank you.